Good afternoon, and thank you for joining us. On behalf of the music department at Mount St. Mary's University, welcome to this virtual performance featuring the winners of our 2020 high school solo and chamber music competition. The current global pandemic has shut down so much of our daily activities, with live performances being severely affected. Moving our competition to an online format cannot replicate the excitement of being together in the same setting but we felt that our current climate needs music and the arts, especially continuing to cultivate our future generation of musicians. We certainly look forward to the time when we can again gather together for live performances. This year, more than 120 high school musicians across the country engaged in our virtual competition. We were impressed by their outstanding musicianship, as well as the sentiments they shared about the important role of music and community building. The judges from Bridge to Everywhere, our ensemble and residents, had the difficult process of selecting the winners from each category. We commend all of our applicants for their dedication and perseverance. Today, we will feature five performances by these talented musicians. To tell us more, I want to hand things over to Derek Spiva, the artistic director of Bridge to Everywhere. Hello, everyone. We begin tonight with the wins and brass category. This year's winner is Zhi Zhao. She is a 10th grader flautist at Orange County School of the Arts in Irvine. Bridge to Everywhere judges were really impressed with Zhi's performance of extended techniques in the piece. These extended techniques really get at the character of the composition, and you could tell that she really internalized that in her execution of all of the different aspects of extended technique flute playing in her performance was something that was really impactful and really stood out to us in her performance.
Thank you, Xi. We would also like to acknowledge our honorable mentions. These young people did incredible performances, yet bridged everywhere, could only choose one winner. They are Julia Benitez Nelson on flute, Daniel Thurmond on clarinet, Brian Lynn on alto saxophone, and Daniel Chavez on flute. Congratulations to all. Next, we are proud to announce that this year's winner in solo strings and guitar is Andrew Chi. Andrew will be playing a Tchaikovsky violin concerto. He will be playing the third movement tonight, but we can't wait to hear him play the entire piece with a full orchestra sometime. Bridge to Everywhere was really impressed by Andrew's performance of such a complex and multifaceted piece. We really loved that he was relaxed and confident throughout the piece, through every moment, despite the intensity and sheer virtuosity that it demanded. This warm tone of vibrato throughout the legato sections carried so much weight and heartache, and the piece was very emotional. You could tell that he really internalized it.
Thank you, Andrew. Our honorable mentions are also important. These students really had incredible performances, yet Bridge to Everywhere was only able to choose one. These performances are from Sarah Cave on cello, Madison O oh on violin, Rana Kumar on violin, and Emily Kim on violin. Congratulations to all. The solo piano category was very competitive. We had a hard time picking just one winner. Our winner this year is Angela Lee with her striking performance of Muczynski's Desperate Measures. Angela is a junior at Pacific Academy in Irvine, California. Bridge to Everywhere was very impressed with Angela's spirited performance. Her playing was very detailed and refined. She had excellent control and it was beautiful dynamic contrast with lots of passion in her playing. Thank you. 
Thank you, Angela, for that performance. We're also proud to congratulate all of our honorable mentions. These young people did incredible performances, but once again, Bridge to Everywhere was only able to choose one. The honorable mentions are Nathan Zhang, Mi Hyun Se, Celine Shen, Ursula Hardiento. Congratulations to all. Maxine Park is a sophomore at Flint Ridge Preparatory School in La Canada, California. Bridge to Everywhere was very impressed with Maxine's stage presence, her intonation, her support, and technique, all on display here. She's our winner for the solo voice category, and she will be singing Mozart. Thank you, Maxine. Our solo voice category also has honorable mentions. These young people did incredible performances, yet Bridge to Everywhere was only able to choose one. These honorable mentions are Alexandra Grace Cook, Aisha Perella, Zoe Isabella Martinez. Congratulations to all. Finally, our chamber music winners are Joshua Cave and Sarah Cave, 
who will be playing Beethoven's eyeglasses duo in E flat major for viola and cello. Bridge to Everywhere was very impressed with how beautifully both of them played. They had a lot of musical communication between them. This was very apparent and allows for a lot of connection and cohesiveness with their duo. They also had beautiful sounds coming from their instruments. They had a balance and an understanding of melodic supportive lines. They also had great energy as individuals and as an ensemble. And it also really seemed like they loved playing together.
We would also like to acknowledge our honorable mentions for the chamber music category, Catherine Cho and Lauren Cho. Congratulations. Now back to you, Therese. Thank you, Derek. Congratulations to all our applicants and their collaborative artists. We were thrilled to receive so many great performances. Also, a huge thanks again to Bridge to Everywhere, our ensemble in residence at MSMU, who adjudicated this year's competition. To learn more about our music department, we hope you will log in for future virtual performances and visit our Shalon and Doheny campuses when safety permits. We encourage you to visit our website and follow us on social media. Throughout history's darkest times, the arts have reminded us of humanity's strength. Artists will never stop working and we will undoubtedly see incredible creations born out of necessity due to this pandemic. But unless we support the arts and the artists in these difficult times, we may lose a breathtaking creation forever. The arts need public support to stay alive. You have most likely listened to music and watched recordings of performances to help get through this pandemic. The livelihood of the numerous musicians involved in many of these projects is on hold as concert programming has been canceled. We'd like to encourage all of you to recognize the many musicians who are currently out of work or struggling to stay afloat. Support public funding of the arts and consider donating to artists you believe in. We close with our best wishes for your health and safety. Thank you again for joining us.